All right. Uh, last game up. North Carolina 59. Now Virginia. mad. Now mad, damn it. <laughs> North Carolina 59, Virginia 39. Um, Virginia, I, it, this was this game was drunk. This game was drunk as hell. Well, halftime, hang on. Halftime, we had a hell of a ball game, and I was in this mother because yes. I got Virginia plus the points, and I got Virginia on money line. And I was up by three. Virginia's going tit for tat with them. It was way more scoring than I thought I was going to get. But we had a ball game in the second half. Sam Howe, what he did in the second half is illegal in like 38 states, okay? It, it you took just them, can't pull your junk out like that and show it to people. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's, it's yeah, absolutely. He, he was a flasher. He was That's what he was doing. Uh, Brennan Armstrong, though, for Virginia. I, I will tell you this. There are people on that Hell staff. No, there, there are people on that staff at Virginia that do not know who this kid is. They have no that's idea insane. what is going. No, that's I, insane. I'm, I'm saying like. He came out of nowhere. He yeah. was not supposed to be this kind of kid. 39 out of 54, 554 oh. yards, four he, touchdowns, one pick. He was unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. He's really special. Now, he's Vir- really good. Virginia running the ball. Is he the best quarterback that you've ever seen in Virginia? Because have we seen Virginia with a really good quarterback before? Yeah, what was the kid you that they and had? You me. Maybe not our grandparents. What what was the kid that uh that they had that took him to the Orange Bowl a few years ago, a couple years ago? He wasn't like a great I, I, I pure think they passer. Did that. I, I did. I think they. I think they did that with uh, defense and running the football. Yeah, it was mostly that. It was mostly that. Uh, that that I, kid I think, wasn't great. I think this this might be the best quarterback we've ever seen in Virginia. Yeah, I think so. I think just pure quarterback. Like he's he's fantastic. Casey said Virginia threw the game away, gave away two touchdowns early, still had a lead at the half. Yeah, because I I had Virginia as well and and missed, but that's what you're gonna have. Sam yeah. Howell, look, fourteen out of twenty one for three hundred seven yards, five touchdowns, one pick. He ran the ball fifteen times for one hundred and twelve yards, and. And Ty Chandler, like we Chandler. we talked about, they had to get their running game going, and they finally he got the running put a game. Two hundred burger on them. Twenty carries for one hundred ninety eight yards. Average nine point nine a carry, two touchdowns. <clears throat> Un- unreal. He is he is he he is this close to ten yards a touch, Gary. Josh Downs, the wide receiver, eight receptions, yeah. two hundred three yards, two touchdowns. They got their guys. They yeah. got their guys. I mean, just this offense. Fine. It took them about three weeks to figure this thing out, but they finally have this thing running like a damn machine. Yes, this Phil Longo offense is is rolling, and the the Jay Bates, uh, Bateman defense. I mean, twenty two carries, twenty four yards, and and only one touchdown for Virginia running the ball. Yeah. Like Bronco likes to run the ball. Well, not in this game. They threw the shit out of it. Yeah, I mean, they had to. They, they were to. they were in this game. I don't think this was a coaching mismatch. I don't think there was mistakes. I think. I think North Carolina's defense made a couple of big plays on third down to get Virginia off the field in the second half, and every time they did, they capitalized. Yeah, no, one hundred percent. Like I just think that's I don't I don't think anybody made any big mistakes. I don't think the turnovers killed them. I don't think I don't think any bonehead things happened. I think North Carolina on a couple of big third downs got big boy plays, and they capitalized every time they did it. Every drive in the second half for North Carolina. Five plays, seventy-four yards, touchdown. Nine plays, thirty-seven yeah. yards, touchdown. That, that was a short plays. drive. That was the yeah. easy one right there. Eight plays, seventy-five yards, touchdown. Nine plays, seventy yards, touchdown. Eight plays, sixty-five yards, touchdown. Yeah. I mean, just ridiculous. Uh, Casey said, "Look for UNC to lose to a bad team soon." He said, "UNC is a joke, and Virginia should be ashamed." <laughs> I, I thought this was exciting football. I was on the wrong side of it, I, and this in Virginia Tech game were as about as flip flopped as they could be in the sense of. I thought I was out of that game early, and then I believed late. This game, I thought I was in it the whole time, and the second half started. And by the middle of the third quarter, I thought, Virginia can't keep up. Nope. Virginia went went bam for bam with them in the first half, and in the second half, it just, it just couldn't do it. North Carolina, one yard the away. The just ran out of gas. Oh, yeah. One, one yard away from 700 for North Carolina for the game. Total offense. Yeah. Just ridiculous. So, all right. And they did it running, and they did it throwing. Yes. It was incredible. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.